Hey guys, Jake Rawls here. Uh, we're battling the Dreadnought, which is the uh, kind of the final mission uh, that you see for... Uh, I guess it's the final mission. It's the final boss that, that you'll find in the new update. And this is kind of a beastly looking ship here. Uh, it looks like something you definitely don't want to mess with. And it's really shocking that this little army that I put together here can take uh, this guy down pretty easily. Um, but if you have the nanopods, Getting two of these uh, battleship, the Mammoth class, the M10s, uh, will make this job a little bit easier and an extra submarine. And the reason why is because some of the attacks that I'm going to show you here do more damage than others uh, against this guy. Because just taking shots at the guy doesn't necessarily mean you're taking the best shots. There's actually two attacks that are kind of obscure on some of your uh, units that will do the most damage to this guy. Uh, that we see. And one here is this one, the sub attack, which right there got a 341 because of a crit. Normally it wouldn't do that high, but this guy takes 80% um, damage from the torpedo, torpedo attack. The only other thing that he takes that much damage from is uh, fire. Now that right there from the destroyer was the second type of attack, was the depth charge, which is a new type of damage. It takes 70% damage from that. And against its base defenses, uh, it takes 110%. So it's pretty nice to, to throw that attack in there against that guy because you're going you're gonna to be cutting him, uh, cutting his armor down quicker and his, uh, his base health. Um, so those are the two attacks that I, I, I like to, to use. Of course, the, uh, <clears throat> these battleship M10s are really nice because you can double up and hit two things at the same time. Uh, doing pretty decent damage against the uh, Dreadnought at the same time as you're trying to uh, take out those two subs. I wouldn't worry about the two subs right off the bat because you really, you can take them out, but that just means you're going to get that thing to fire at you more. Uh, and to me, I just think it's a, it's better to uh, get attacked by the subs than it is to get attacked by the Dreadnought. Here I'm going to take a torpedo attack again, 165 damage, 40% of that's going uh, to armor piercing, which, which is good. So this guy's just about lost his armor here, and 246, so now you're starting to see he takes 115% uh, damage against his uh, normal health, not his armor. And see now, I peeled away his armor, so he's, he's taking more damage now. He's going to die a lot quicker uh, now that I've, I've peeled off his armor. So... You want to use. You want to be strategic with this. This attack here, um, if you try to hit the sub and him at the same time, it won't. Uh, even though it looks like it's going to hit the guy on the back end, but it's 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 not going to hit him. So don't waste that attack. Um, so basically, I just kind of peel away using these depth charges. See, two hundred and seventeen. Uh, he's taking right now 110% with the uh, depth charge attack. Uh, that's why that that shot is is doing so well against him right now. And just a few more shots here, and this guy will be destroyed. Now, I wish this boss was a reoccurring boss. That way, uh, you can fight him uh, pretty re fight him regularly, uh, like the Sentinel and other things. And I wish it kind of had a boss uh, reward to it which uh, may be something that they'll do in the future. Or this could be just like the X-17, where you never see it again, which is probably likely. Oh, well. Um, well, with the boss strike coming up, there should be some interesting units that'll come out of that that might make this battle even more easier uh, to deal with. Uh, but... Uh, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Also, you do have to kill both subs uh, to complete the mission, so don't think you're done yet. And those pesky subs are pretty nasty uh, creatures because uh, when, <clears throat> if they do hit you and they do get a good a crit, then there's a great chance that they will they will sink your battleship. Look at that damage it took against on that guy. And there's one more attack. He wipes out two more units, <clears throat> uh, which is quite evil of them. Which I feel like I took more damage from the subs than I did the, the Dreadnought. Yeah, look at that. Bam! It's terrible that at the end I have to lose uh, the most units. So here I am going to peel away his armor. 
uh, with this attack, and then I'll follow it up with a submarine attack <clears throat> and just wipe, wipe him out. All right, the boss strike is coming up soon. I'll be doing some videos on some of those units and uh, also looking forward to seeing what kind of special promo unit that Z2 has for us here. Um, all right, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. See you soon during the boss strike. And enjoy some turkey!